Hey everyone, and we're back. My name is Miss Guy Tanager, and we're playing some Mass Effect. And I need to go see if I can go find another deposit before we leave, and possibly go back to the Citadel and have some fun there. Because we've got quite a few side quests on the Citadel we need to worry about. And then eventually, maybe we'll go to Novaria. There's quite a few side quests there as well. Hello? Nope, just in a flat plane now. I like the flat planes. It's so much easier to run around when everything is flat. It just makes everything easier, everything better. I'm attacking with my thighs. I'm actually just hitting the controller against my thigh. Hi, ah, I knew there was going to be another one somewhere. Because like I said, I'm pretty sure there's almost always two. Monkeys! Kimons! Or, well, they're not actually monkeys. They look like monkeys, but they're not monkeys. They're not as monkey as you see other guys. What are these out. things? What are these things? Oh my god, they're so cute! They're so freaking cute! Aw, they don't have eyes, though. Okay, let's go get ourselves some gold. Gold. Gold, I like the gold. Bonk, 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 bonk. Yay, I got some gold. Get into the vehicle and leave the, to the Normandy. So then we can go to the Citadel. Yay. Because I'll have to check, but I think I have some side quests that we need to do on the Citadel. I think. And then we'll go do Novaria. Yeah, I gotta break it up. Yeah, storyline quest, then a little bit of side quest, then a little bit of storyline, then a little bit of side quest, etc. etc. We've also got the DLC to do. Yes, I have every single Mass Effect DLC installed. The only one that I don't have is the station for this game. Like it's like pro. Whatever, it started with a P. Um, mostly because, if I remember correctly, they couldn't port it to the PS3. There was something wrong with the coding. And it's not a storyline DLC anyway, so I don't care that much. Okay. Why did I leave over there? <laughs> that was silly, Scarlet. Okay. Let's see here. What do I have? Race against interest. Race against time. I'm not going to Vermeer. No. Find the conduit. Go to Novaria. Well, I could, but... Okay, sorry writings. Dead scientists. Terrain insignias. Okay, these are just things that I find. Um, the marine cluster. Don't care. I'll be there eventually. I'll be there eventually. I'll go there eventually. Wait, I still didn't get the... I still didn't finish the gap in the tunnels? What? No! No, 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 I destroyed that transmitter! Game probably glitched or something. I think it's Masana. Masana in the Presidium Lounge. Valuable minerals. Unusual readings. Jalid. I need to talk to Jalid. Return to Fist's office. No, 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 beyond the look Oh, I need to go back to Fist's office. Okay. So we're going to the Citadel. Message coming in. After we talked to Hackett, Patching it through. Oops. I reviewed your report on the situation, Commander. I'm glad to see you were able to take Dr. Wayne in alive. Oh, now thanks. we can put him on trial and get some answers. Corporal Toome seems to have found some closure. Hopefully with therapy, he'll have a normal life again someday. I hope this helped you find some peace, Commander. Thank you. Fifth fleet out. Well, Tubes was my bro. He was my broski. I had to help him out. Broski. Is that everything in the Kepler Verge? I think so. It looks like it. Okay. Citadel! 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 Commander, urgent message from Alliance Command coming in. I'll I didn't pass do it, it through. <laughs> Shepard, this is Admiral Hackett from Alliance Command. 
We've got a situation here, and you're the only one that can handle it. Uh, how am I the only one? What do you need, Admiral? There's an Alliance training ground where we test weapons and technology and live fire simulations. One of the VIs we use to simulate enemy tactics in the drills is no longer responding to our override commands. It's gone rogue. How can a VI go Are rogue? Are you telling me this computer is thinking on its own? We're not stupid, Shepard. This is a virtual intelligence, not a true AI. It's not self-aware, and it can't access <laughs> Except it is self-aware now. We didn't do anything <laughs> illegal here. Virtual it's intelligence easy. support is critical to our military success. VIs process thousands of status reports and react in nanoseconds. No human can do that. We need you to fight your way through the training ground of the VI core and manually disable it. This is the only option? Can't you disable it remotely? Our fail-safes aren't responding. The VI operates on a closed network. It can affect any external systems, but we don't have any direct access to its processes. We could bomb it from orbit, but the damage to the facility would be catastrophic. We'd prefer to have someone shut down the core. Someone like you. Sorry, I know Spectre's answer the council, but you're still human. You're still part of the Alliance military, and right now we need you. The VI controls all the facilities, weapons, drones, and automated defenses. You're the only one that can pull this off, Shepard. Good luck. Okay, I'll do it later. <laughs> Also, yeah, um, I can't, I think it's Mass Effect 3 where you can ask this, it's either 2 or 3, but you can actually ask Edie about it, and she is the VI on the lunar base. <laughs> yep, she became self-aware and opened her eyes to being an artificial intelligence. And that's how Edie was born, and I shut her down, because <laughs> I'm mean. Not that we know that at this moment, but that's... Problem for future Scarlet. Saving data, do not turn off your system. Okay. Clicks the power button. <laughs> Hi, Joker! Bye, Joker. Should probably go sell some things, too. Should. You know, we're gonna do that first. I'm gonna go into the belly of the Normandy, and I'm going to outfit everybody else on my team. Not because I'm going to use them, but just because it's probably what I would have done in that situation. Because they're probably off doing other missions while I'm on the ground with Tali and Garrus. I seriously doubt they're just sitting on the ship waiting to be pulled out. I don't think that's how science works. Hi, Caden. I am not going to romance you. This is my locker. Everybody else's lockers are downstairs. I know how to play this game, I swear. We just got to slowly go around Shep. She looks so weird in this light. Just like fake face kabuki makeup or something. I don't know why the lighting does that to her only in the elevators. Or to me, I guess. Okay, let's equip Liara. Do we have anything for- oh, Liara can wear human stuff. It's kind of funny that nobody else can, but... Uh oh, 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 I know you can't have that. It's for Krogan's. Um, let's give you this one. Why not? And she mostly uses pistols. So I have this one. Oh, wait a minute. Have that one. Take that. And that one. That's it for you. We've already equipped Tolly. Haven't equipped Rex in a while. 
Warlord. Wait a minute. He should be able to wear that. Oh, it won't let me equip. Ah, frickin' hell. Gosh darn it, Nappa. I just want to... Fine. They, they haven't had their abilities done yet. <laughs> Oops. So he can't equip any of the heavy Krogan stuff? Which means he gets no armor. You know, this was a good idea in thought, but screw it. And I, I ain't got time for this. I'm not going to be using anybody but Garrison Tully anyway. <laughs> See? I look much prettier there. Much less kabuki makeup. Actually, it looks kind of like me. Sometimes, sometimes my hair goes red in the light. Well, Shepard's hair goes red in the light. Sometimes mine does too, if it's the right lighting, but not as red as hers goes. Okay, now we're actually going to leave the Normandy. Mm, click. Which I think means I gotta go this way. Hi, Presley. Bye, Presley. Wait, wait, did I miss experience points? What? 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 Ha! Ha! Experience! Exit the Normandy. Mine, mine, go. That is my party, and that will be my party. It's like having Sarah and Varric and Iron Bull in Dragon Age Inquisition. Why would you use anybody else? Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Let me out! Logged. The out. commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. Presley's in charge. Everybody's screwed. Hi there. Rear Admiral Mihailovic, 5th Fleet. This is a surprise. We weren't told to expect you, sir. I would have prepared a formal greeting. Spare me the pleasantries. I command the 63rd Scout Flotilla. You and the Normandy were slated for my unit after shakedown. Ah, uh -huh, but the then this happened. Their paws, claws, tentacles, whatever. They got them on our ship and you. Think of it as an opportunity. I still serve the Alliance, sir. As a Spectre, I can advance our interests to the Council. Huh. You still know what color your blood is, Shepard? Oh, shut your face, you racist. I don't begrudge the politician's decision to throw you to the Council. It's an opportunity. I do begrudge this over-designed piece of tin, though. Ah! Uh, don't insult my ship! This ship has saved our lives a dozen times over. An exaggeration. I've read your reports. This experiment diverted billions from our appropriations bills. For the same price, we could have had a heavy cruiser. Your neck you know, is glitching through your we neck. We make nice to the Turians, throw money at a co-developed boondoggle. I'm here to make an inspection, Commander. Normandy is an Alliance warship. I intend to see she's up to snuff. Please do. We'd be honored to show her to you, Admiral. I'll just bet. Wait You're here. Jackass. Commander, I'm not happy. <laughs> I bet. <laughs> Sounds like a fairly common situation. Commander, I suggest you secure your mouth. It's going to get you in trouble. <laughs> Who designed that CIC? <laughs> Have I ever done this? Putting the commander aft of everyone else is inefficient. What if he needs to discuss with the operators toward the bow? It's Turian design. Modified Turian style. They prefer commanders looking over their subordinates rather than in the middle of them. We wanted to see how effectively they can command with that setup. Hmm. Reasonable goal, but they should have studied that in a lab rather than on a frontline warship. I had to shake my head at that drive core of yours. 120 billion credits of element zero to make this thing able to move without giving itself away. You realize we could make drive cores for 12,000 fighters with that money? What good is it to hide for a few hours anyway? Use it's It's useful! We can loiter in an enemy system and monitor traffic, or drop infiltration teams on enemy worlds. Normandy could be more effective than the Solarian STG. Maybe, maybe. But that's not the job of a proper warship. It's We're not a proper warship, it's a kill stealth the enemy ship! Fleet, not count how many times their garrison goes to the bathroom. And we need to talk about your crew, Commander. Why? Oh, don't you Krogan? dare. Yes. Asari? Yes. Turians? Yes. What are you thinking, Commander? 
You can't allow alien nationals free access to Alliance equipment. Racist! Between Saren and the Geth, we have enough enemies out here. Treating other species with suspicion and distrust won't win hearts and minds. That assumes the hearts and minds are worth winning. That hasn't been proven yet. Racist. Do you have anything else to say, Commander? Any yes. other justifications for the You're state of racist. this racist! You are racist! I think Normandy is a good ship, sir. Even if you disagree, you have to see that her joint construction and multiracial crew make the Alliance look better. Your job is to look good, Commander. The Alliance navies I do to win wars. I'm not convinced Normandy isn't a waste of taxpayer money, but I am convinced that you believe otherwise, and that you'll use it to its best ability. I'll be submitting a report to the Joint Military Council. It will not be as negative as I planned. Good, now get Good the hell out of my Shepard. sight, racist. Take us proud. Get out of my sight. Get out of my sight before I shoot you in the face. Okay. Tali is still poisoned? I had to have glitched the game. That's not how science works. Oh, well, we'll just have to find her a new suit. New suit for Tali. I will splurge After money to buy After years of poor suit. economic Ooh. performance, Exogeny has announced that its research colony on Pharos is finally returning a profit. New discoveries and a dedicated colonization effort have finally paid off for Exogeny. But, Exogeny's but you guys stock pulled out rose sharply with the announcement, <laughs> with investors pleased at this surprising news. But they pulled out of Pharos. What? <laughs> Loading screens take a long time. Okay. There we go, we're about there. Okay, now I need to go talk to Jalid. Commander oh. Shepard, sorry to bother you. This is Lieutenant Girard down in the docking bay. There is a woman here. Uh, she was rescued from Batarian slavers a few weeks ago. She is from Mindoir. I guess My she was home. taken in the raid on your town. Well, my parents died. You mean she was taken in the raid that killed my parents? Yes, ma'am. Sorry, ma'am. She got free somehow, grabbed a gun from one of my guys. Now she's holed up here in the docking bay. She, uh, she says she wants to die. Aww. I hoped you'd talk to her. It's a long shot, but you went through the same thing. The raid. I figured maybe you could talk her out of her tree. I'll help. I'm on my way, Lieutenant. Sit tight. Anything you could do would be great. I don't want to. Uh, she's been through enough. I'll have my men stand by. For you. <laughs> That's one of the saddest side quests that I've seen. We're gonna do that one in another episode. Cause I've got other stuff to do. We'll do it when we leave the Citadel. Cause I don't feel like having feels right now. Oh, wait a minute, what? Requisition officer. One sec, looking you up. I, R. Spectre, give me stuff. Hello, Commander. Hi. I need stuff. Show me what you got. Show me what you got. Sounds good. Just let me set you up. Well, this must be a mistake. What? System's telling me to offer you our select stock. Spectre? Well, I heard about that, but I didn't realize it was you. Sorry, Commander. No problem. Just show me what you've got. I'll open the rare stocks for you, Commander. Enjoy. Yeah! I am a Spectre! I am a Spectre! Can't afford that yet, though. But sell some stuff. And by stuff, I mean... Selling everything. Um, keep one of that. Sell these. Bada 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 Ah, we'll think about it. Might buy that later. 
do I have any upgrades? That's what I'm mostly looking for. Come on. Keep going. I will take this, and I will take this. And I will run away. Run away! Scan. Nope. Already scanned him. Okay. Jaleed is somewhere around here. Down here, perhaps? I look so pretty with my white with my white suit. Um, no, I don't think he's there. That's an elevator. Okay, I guess I thought he was down there, but I guess that's where requisitions is. There's some Salarians. Jaleed. There he is. Hi, Jaleed. We have a quest to turn in. Hello again. Did you have any luck finding Shorbin? I found yes, out you've been lying to me, Jaleed. Lying? Why would I lie to you? You forgot to mention the data about the Keeper. Uh, he told you? Yep. I, I didn't mean for any of this to happen. I was afraid Shorbin would kill me to get the data, so I... Well, I was hoping you'd take care of him. Wow. I'm scanning the keepers for Shorbin, but you two need to stop fighting. Yeah, they're freaking guys. Knock it off. But yes, I am. Now shush. Well, if you say so. Well, if Shorbin can forgive and forget, then so can I. Forgive and forget that I they tried to murder each other. Commander. I better go get that data analyzed. Okay. Now, what else do we have to do? I remember me. Oh, I don't want to do I remember me. It's going to make me cry again. And yes, I have cried during that quest. Um, I prefer to only as Cerberus. <gasps> Cerberus. Um, sorry, diplomat. There we go. I'm sorry, I'm sorry Ambassador of the Citadel. She wants to meet you in person. Embassy Lounge. I can go to the Embassy Lounge. So we can meet this Asari Ambassador person. Where's the... Oh, no! <laughs> oh, no! Kalisa bin seen in Aljilani, Westernland News. Would you like a few questions for our viewers? Sure. What do you want to know? You've been given a unique position to represent our race. People want to get a sense of how you'll do that. Humans have been trying to get the respect of the galactic community for 26 years. With that in mind, what are your feelings on being the first human specter? Um, it's honored. The specters honored. represent the best of every species in the galaxy. To be asked to join them is an honor. Some have said your appointment is the Citadel throwing humans a bone. Have you Throwing encountered any bone? situations where the Citadel asked you to place its needs before the needs of Earth? Wow! <laughs> they know better. Uh, it's not like that, honey. The Council is concerned with the needs of the whole galactic community. We're part of that community now. Our needs are on their agenda, but we're one of many. You really do believe that, don't you? You've been given command of an better advanced than human else. warship for your missions. Is there anything you'd like to say about it? Great human innovation. I wish I could have done that, but the Turians helped build it. Actually, the Normandy was co-developed by human and Turian engineers. Its design incorporates many innovations, all of which are classified, I'm afraid. <laughs> so, oh, the Turians have knowledge of the Normandy that is being kept secret from the Alliance public? Oh my god. Do you think it was appropriate to hand Earth's most advanced warship over to the Citadel? No, this interview's over. <laughs> I wasn't aware it had been handed over to anyone. I'm in command, and last I checked, I'm human. Same goes for my crew. Human, Except for the yes, others. But you do work for the Citadel now, Commander. One last question, Commander. Rumors back home say you're tracking a rogue specter named Saren. Do you have any comment on that? Um, time to shut you up. I can neither confirm nor deny that. I can neither confirm nor deny that. I'm afraid I can't comment on whatever my current assignment may or may not be. Don't worry, we'll find out. The eyes of Earth are on you. Don't let us down. Thank you for your time, Commander Shepard. This woman! I haven't punched her in the face yet, but it might happen someday. Maybe. We'll see. 
Is that a green thing? A one of the, the, the things with the stuff? Oh, wait. I need to go over here. Green things with the stuff. I'm so eloquent. Uh, keepers, yes. The green things are the keepers. I think. Maybe. Embassies. Then we have to go talk to the Asari, who's probably, if I remember correctly, going to get us to talk to another chick. Hmm, stretch. Do, 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 do. Let me move. Stop it with your auto-saving nonsense. I only turned you back on because I lost an hour and or thirty something minutes of footage. Or well, not footage, but progress. Welcome to the Presidium. Allow Shut up, Alina. Nobody likes you. We should have an Asari around here somewhere. I see an exclamation mark. That's probably the Asari. Um. Or it's. Oh, there she is! <laughs> Commander Shepard, I am Nasana Dantius. I see you got my message. Yes, I did. It sounded like you needed some help. I do. My sister Dahlia is a crewman on the cargo vessel operating out beyond the fringes of the Traverse. Her ship was attacked by privateers. There were no reported survivors. Uh, I know what this is about. You want me to hunt down the people who killed her? This is where it gets complicated. Last week, I received a message with her voice on it. Dahlia is alive! The rest of the crew was killed, but she was taken prisoner. The slavers demanded a huge ransom from me in exchange for returning her unharmed. Why was your sister spared? Why the raiders killed Dahlia along with everyone else? My sister probably told them who she was. My family's very wealthy, Shepard. They must have realized she was worth more to them alive. Uh... Don't pay the ransom. What's my part? Do you want me to deliver the ransom? <sighs> I've already transferred the funds to the account they specified. Only they never released her. They haven't contacted me since. I've made a terrible mistake, Shepard. I'm a diplomatic emissary. By law, I'm required to report any attempted extortion to CSEC immediately. But I was afraid for Dahlia, so I just paid the ransom. There's I'm something more missing. going on here. And if anyone finds out what I did, I could end up in jail. That's a stupid law. Why would they put you in jail? You're the victim here. Government representatives on the Citadel are not allowed to negotiate with terrorists. It's too dangerous. Paying a ransom would only encourage more kidnappings. I support the law in theory, but when I got the message, all I could think about was Dahlia's safety. I doubt they would actually send me to prison for what I did, but they would strip me of my post, and Dahlia would still be in the hands of the slavers. Um, so you came to me? You want me to find her and bring her back? You only need to bring her back. I've already found her for you. I tracked the ransom payment through several accounts. Eventually, it led to a small mercenary band operating out of the Artemis Tau Cluster. Of course it did! I need you to go to the Merc base, take them out, and bring my sister back. You shall be well rewarded. Kidnappers. Anything you can tell me about the Mercs who have your sister? Pretty much what you'd expect. Rough, dangerous, and well-armed. Nothing a Spectre cannot handle, though. Why me? Can't you hire someone else to do this? I do not want to take chances with my sister's life. I need a Spectre. Besides... You operate outside official channels. She's not telling My me anything. The cannot find out I never reported the ransom in the first place. Tracking the ransom. How'd you find out who was behind the ransom? I have resources. Contacts and credits can I go a long way. I have resources, really? Especially if you're willing to bend the rules. I already broke the law when I paid the ransom. This couldn't make things any worse. I'll do it. Don't worry. I'll bring your sister back. Thank you, Shepard. I knew you were the right woman for the job. Come back and right. see when the job is done. Okay, that is also the end of this video. My name is Miss Garrett, and I've been playing some nice fun. I'll see you all.